Um, I, I don't know how to start this at all. I, like, re-recording this for, like, the third, fourth time, whatever. I, I don't know how to start this. Um, I, I just want to say, before we dive into it, welcome to part two of me diving into the SML wiki. We're going to see if we're going to try to break some stuff down, because I know how to decode some stuff, kind of. Not really, but, but I kind of do. But that's besides the point. Um, I just want to say thank you guys so much for all the support you've been giving me. I did not expect that not one bit. I actually thought that video kind of sucked. But it's nice to know people actually enjoyed it and like I gained an audience from this. So it really means a lot that you guys decide to check me out, subscribe, watch what I put out. It really means a lot. And I, I just want to thank you guys so much for that. I just could not believe it. I got overwhelmed. I was like, there's no way. There's no way all these people are coming in. It, it just blew my mind. So I just want to thank you guys so much for that. Um, it, it honestly means a lot to me. I, um... <laughs> I'll make it on to with the part two. I just needed to thank you real quick. I'm probably gonna thank you again at the end of the video because that's just how I am. So without further ado, let's dive into part two of me diving into this my wiki. Let's see if we can find out. Oh, but before we do, um, I know I'm all over the place. I have no script with this. But before we do, please check out part one if you haven't already. I mean, you probably don't necessarily need to watch part one because I kind of just sat there and was like reading stuff and then just gonna give like a brief overview of what SML is. And a bit of like the wiki so we kind of just dived into it we read some stuff we discovered a couple of things so go check that out if you want to um you don't necessarily need to watch it to watch this video because in this video i'm hoping to be more interesting more to find more stuff see what we can find out so yeah and i feel weird for saying this but please subscribe please leave a like please leave a comment i love reading comments i love responding to them it's a lot of fun and i just i don't know i feel weird saying all that because it feels like i'm just like begging for stuff but I don't know, but it just means a lot with you when you guys do that. But other than that, let's just dive into part two for sure now. I hope you guys enjoy. Welcome back. Um, as you can see here, my screen size isn't supported and whatnot. I am on mobile, so I may miss a few things. I may not. It all depends. We'll, we have to work with what we got. Unfortunately, I just have an iPad, so I do apologize if I don't find the things you guys want me to find, or if I miss stuff, it could be because it's just not popping up for me. But, without further ado, let's get this started. Proceed as is. I, I wish I had like a finger tracker. Hi again, Logan. I wish I had a finger tracker so you could see where I tap, but unfortunately I don't have access to that, so... Um, yeah. Um, anyways, so let's just dive right into it. So I heard a couple things from you guys. A couple of you guys left some comments on my video sitting, talking about some stuff and I'm sitting here like, okay, all right, all right, I'll see what I can find out. So we're going to see what we find. So although I do prefer, you guys can help guide me, but don't like spoil things for me, okay? Because I want to have like raw reactions to stuff. So something happens if we click Logan and we just stay right there. I don't know if it'll happen, but something happens apparently. <laughs> oh, oh shit, okay. Hello. Oh, so that's what you guys were talking about referring to. Uh, there was a no sound with that one, so uh, I don't know if there was supposed to be, but oh, well, there's that. All right, let's get to character investigating because I, I really want to read more. But I also want to check out the house again. Let's see. Okay, so we have the outside of the house. <gasps> oh, I can investigate more. The chandelier swinging. Okay, let's find out. So I have to click the chandelier. Okay, okay, it's working now. I wish there was like music or sound. Okay, so here's the old house. Um, oh! Bedroom A. Right, there's names. If I go through there, that's going back. So here's bedroom A. I wonder if there's anything in there. I've turned up my brightness. I feel like I see something there. That looks like someone, doesn't it? I don't know. Um, is that all I can look through? There's somebody there. I don't know what it is. Okay. So we're looking through the house. 
That chandelier's swinging. I wish I could click it. Oh, here's the kitchen. Oh, kitchen view A. Yeah, I remember this kitchen back in the older days. I remember it. I remember it. one of my first SML videos was Bowser's Dilemma. That might have been my very first one. I don't know if I watched it anymore, but like anytime I think of SML, I always think back to Bowser's Dilemma and I always remember the kitchen. I remember he would like stand by the door. Oh, kitchen view B. Guys, I'm like gonna well, terrified I might find something here. No, nothing. <laughs> well, we find Chef Pee Pee. <laughs> But I remember, with this door, I remember I'd, remember I'd see Bowser looking out, and I think that was even the thumbnail for it. So I remember I was watching that. It was very, very interesting. Like, that's when I got, like, hooked to everything. Jesus. That room. <laughs> There's something there. I don't know what it is. Here's the kitchen. Here's that. There's not much more I can look with here. Interesting, interesting. I don't know. There's gotta be something in here. I just don't know what to find. Because, like I said, not a lot of things may work for me as I'm on mobile. So. But that chandelier moving! Can I click it? Let's see. No, nothing's happening. Interesting. That faces look like they're blacked out. Weird. Front door handle. So very strange. So let's go back. Alright, let's get to... Actually, I want to break something down here. Hi there! Oh, I'm interrupting you as I'm like editing this. I'm looking back. At my old video, I hadn't rewatched my old video before I dived into this. I just remembered what I checked on and whatnot. But throughout the video, you hear me say like, Oh, I swear Lovell had a code. I swear Lovell had a code. Turns out, it's not Lovell who had the code. It was actually Mr. Goodman. And I just was misremembering, so I'm very sorry with that. Yeah, you're just gonna realize that I'm misremembering things and whatnot. It's, it's really annoying. I'll fix that in next time I do something like that. I'll... I'll try and improve on that. So, uh, I'm trying to make live in it up a bit. So, um, once again, this is gonna have a flash warning. Or was it here? Something had a code, and I swear it was Charlie's. There was a code there. I'll have to look back on my video and look at stuff. These size are a trade. Once a winner, always a winner. That didn't change. It's too gruesome blood. Because he died without any mercy. So, oh, Jesus fucking Christ. So, or was it... Let's see. Bloodshed, bloodshed, bloodshed. Is that a code at all? That might be a code or something. Let's see. Copy. I don't know. Let's find out. Uh, okay. Let's get back to reading about characters. Alright. Let's see here. I do have a theory, guys. I have a theory. I have a very, very big theory. Um, my theory, my theory is that it's Jeffy is behind this. I generally think Jeffy is behind this. Uh, maybe, maybe I'll make a video like literally try to break down the lore. Jesus, Patrick does not look good to break down the lore. I do not know, but. I'm pretty sure Jeffy's behind this because of how he talks about Marvin. How he's like a screaming, balding, red in the face, like, lazy piece of fuck. So, Jeffy, you are stupid. Oh, oh, get my head all sorry. I'm in the mood to stick up to. Fuck you, Jason Crab giving birth. Fuck you. And like, I remember, they'll call, he'll call uh, Rose his bimbo wife. Yeah, see, he gets no head from his bimbo wife. And if I remember correctly, Jeffy called her his bimbo wife. If I'm remembering correctly, Jeffy did. I swear... Homer. That's a link. <laughs> I think that's just it! Oh 
Oh my god, I think that's Maybe. just it. Oh my god, someone in my comments section told me what apothesis in a basement means. I gotta- let me look at that real quick, guys. Let me look at that. I gotta look at that. Somebody told me what it means. Somebody- somebody, like, told me what it meant, and so I'm over here like, Okay, thank you, and I'm gonna read it to you guys. Shout out to everyone who's, like, telling me, like, some, like, give me some, like, places to check out and, like, helping me, like, figure some things out. But once again, don't spoil stuff for me, because I want to know things. I want to figure stuff out. So, let me see here. So, this person left the comment, Crazy Matthew, said, Apotheosis is a quote, is the quote, highest point, and a basement is degradation or humiliation. So, it's his highest point is this, and then when he was in degradation, humiliation, he was like that. So, that makes a lot of sense. Thank you for defining that for me, because there's a lot of stuff I don't know, because I don't know words, like, at all, because <laughs> I suck, right? I swear- I'm sorry, I'm still hung up with the fact that Lovell, he had a code and I needed to figure it out. Sorry, we're quickly looking through stuff, see if I missed anything. We already listened to the embarrassing song. Um, died former- uh, rest in peace, Joseph. Oh, somebody told me who Phoebe was, it was like a new character, so obviously I wouldn't know much about him. Um, shout out to that person who told me who Phoebe was. <laughs> His friend from school. Shrek. It's the same video. I don't want I don't want to deal with that same freaking video. All right, I want to look at Golden Nugget. I want to know what Golden Nugget's all about. Golden Chicken Nugget. The page for the SML movie The Golden Nugget redirects you on here. You can watch the video itself here. Okay. Let's see. Oh. Hello. Gets like get gets hacked. Oh, the golden nugget, so it came from 18 hours ago. 18 hours ago, I wonder if that's- no way that's new, right? Ronald McDonald isn't happy. Dismiss. Oh man, I'm ready for movie night. What movie do you guys want to watch? Let's watch a comedy. Oh, I got something hilariously bad. We should watch 80 for Brady. We can take a shot every time it sucks. I think we can black out in the first 10 Aww, minutes. Aw, so it looks like, like a cute actual... movie to me. Yeah, cute. Hungry time. What? Oh, Jeffy has a hungry bell. Whenever he's hungry, he rings that bell. McDonald's. He's we'll get hungry. You... Mm, he says I would eat him. Hmm. McDonald's. Nuggies. We'll get you nuggies. Sauce. We'll get you sauce. Is he gonna do this the whole movie? Jeffy, if you be quiet the entire movie and don't ring your bell, we'll get you McDonald's. Okay. Alright, I'll go put the movie in. <laughs> Looks like I'm sitting pretty, boys. I got 20. Yeah, but well, I have two kings. 21, you all lose. Damn it! Can I it? Go it. So, sorry, because I'm like... It's... I think it's just hey, an hey, actual... My episode because it's, it's literally sml so i think that's the actual episode um so golden chicken nugget general info the golden chicken nugget was seen roaming around the old school sml movie appropriately named sml movie the golden nugget old school that ain't old school to me <laughs> its species is currently unknown the golden chicken nugget has many secrets which are named in the next paragraph the golden chicken nugget <laughs> looking stupid as hell <laughs> me too its biggest secret is that it's actually not golden, nor is it a chicken nugget. This is because Ronald McDonald is stupid. Dot, dot, dot. The chicken nugget cannot talk. It is entirely with no brain or vocal cords. Me too, brother. Oh! Ronald McDonald. Why, why am I getting Cartman? Hello? <laughs> okay. Interesting. Cartman, hi. So, I guess some toy here. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Alright, and so Sandman, we're gonna look at Sandman now. Fuck you, okay. Appearance. Sandman has 12 eyes and is a banana split, typically resembling a mother, father, and child. He will morph and take this form, hybrid, hybrid from form of a hybridized caterpillar moth-like beast, shrieking to vex his prey. Personality. He has 12 eyes and is friends with every banana that's split. Okay. Da, da, da. By mending broken bones, thou shalt shall exterminate within sacrifice the pain, suffering endured of the un unruly acts of vig vigor. 
Sandman pre-death was a strong belief in fighting fire with fire, payback against the axe ruin gods like Theomolin and Vigor in the form of the equally enriches act to split the face of evil, so to speak, believing two wrongs ultimately right said wrongs. This mindset is heavily criticized by the SML fandom for being a subject in nature. I don't know what that means. So we just got it. Sorry, I'm like reading stuff and I'm trying to understand it, so to speak. Does this Sandman play a role then? Maybe? I don't know. Guys, I'm like trying to investigate, but at the same time, I may not understand certain things. And then some things may go over my head because I'm a little dumb. I'm a little stupid. Okay, Zach. Question mark, question mark, question mark, question mark. Who the hell is Zach? Zach is played by Pooby. That's all we know. Page submitted by Anonymous. Uh, like, these are all like. I uh, believe, like, fans who submitted it. Pooby. Oh, you're Pooby. Hi again. Hi, Pablo. She died with mercy. Bloodshed, bloodshed, bloodshed. Interesting. Okay. I still think that's a code. Let's see. The silhouette. Interesting. These are all, like, submissions, so I don't know. Silhouette is a creature entity of mysterious origin. It seems to have been a human at some point, but it is not anymore. It is known to stalk those who treat on the near grounds of the old house. We know what the old house. It makes barely audible creaking sounds wherever it goes. Clearest photo of the entity, so I think that's what we've been seeing pop up. A portrait. Okay. By Sephiriel. The entity behavior. The entity tends to st stay close to dark corners or small spaces that have walls and other obstacles blocking any proper view of what's front or behind at any given moment. For this reason, you're more likely to encounter indoors rather than outdoors. Those who have encountered being have report have those who have encountered this being have reportedly became cursed in one way or another. This terrestrial limits of what the entity is capable of undermine other information. At this time, information on silhouette is scarce. It is not easily obtainable. What is known is the fact that the entity is hostile and highly territorial. If you ever see its face, it would be in your own best interest to escape into an open outdoor area with no walls. That makes no sense. Oh, with no walls. Oh wait, yeah, no, that makes sense. Sorry. This is, however, known to not always work. Some claim that Land Scott is powered through the connection of silhouette, whether the entire entity manifested or later through some spiritual or supernatural event or even a curse. Though this makes logical sense, it is only speculation. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, so I don't think these are entirely... Maybe they play a role in the lore, but these are submitted by folks. But I don't know. Maybe... Like, this is like SML, not SML, this, maybe this is like Welcome Home, or like, it's a website trying to piece stuff together, like, similar aspect to that. Maybe it's like that, and so whoever's submitting these things is actually not actual people, but rather people within this universe, maybe? Description. So, Judy Nutkiss. Judith Nutkiss, that's uh, Cody's mom. Judith was the mother of Cody. She lived for lived a fulfilling life, having many affairs until her husband found out. She was 42. Nowadays, she's grieved for her child. Her whole... Her hold disgusts me. I'm assuming that refers to her face. Appearance. Brown hair with pale skin. Wears an old pink jacket and appears to be fat. Massive hole where her face used to reside. Okay, I thought so. Saturday night trivia. Hello? Can I... Saturday night trivia. Hello? There we go. She slept with many men. I love her hair! Once, when looked for her child and screaming, she, as often she did, she came across something. She stopped screaming since that day. Looks for her child. Is this referring to Cody? Yes. Okay, so that's referring to Cody. Okay. Mama Luigi. Did we cover Mama Luigi? So now Mama Luigi was one of the original characters. This character is completely anonymous as its history and understanding is likely to have been made conventionally by the crew. The name the this the, the fan the name is a fan name to our current understanding of the crew. We'll look at the crew soon. Classified, occupied, classified, appearance. Mama Luigi is like some sort of thing. This is a code of some kind. The crew, yeah, okay, makes sense. Okay. Hmm. Interested. I don't know how much we'll find in this, because I'm just reading stuff.
Junior Junior. Little shit dead. <laughs> LMAO. <laughs> Chef Cock did not want to pay his child support. <laughs> I can believe that. Being fucking na occupation being a fucking nasty little bitch. Damn. He used to so quotes. He used to sing this weird ass nursery rhyme. I am made of bone and skin, blood and mucus and cartilage. Tear me apart limb to limb and watch my soul rise again. Feed the beast, water the flower, listen to the devil, I'm all in his power. Suffer the consequence so richly earned. For you, my dear, are left to burn. Hell is where you'll be. Your suffering will last an eternity. Gross. I wonder where that's from. Time to look things up! Whippy! I just have to look more into it. Patrick. Bro, Patrick does not look good! <laughs> Patrick Coleman. So, let's see. Died in 2018 while being cooked in an industrial oven at 650 degrees. The incident caused his skin to melt, leading to his organs falling out. Some say he tried being a pizza and got in on his own will. Okay, Patrick, he's a little stupid, I remember that. Patrick Coleman is really cool. Oh yeah, that's right, he has a speech bit of it. Patrick Coleman is really crazy and hyperactive. He was diagnosed with attention deficit hyperactivity disorder, or ADHD, which leads to his crazy behavior. If he drinks soft drinks, he will most likely be hyperactive and could possibly pass out. This is so crazy, so crazy, crazy, it's crazy, so. I hate mommy not letting me watch Spongebob. I love Spongebob. Oh crap, it's the cops. Wiener man. That's the wiener man. Sorry, Junior. I can't. I'm being chased by a bear right now. Yeah, my mom dropped me off a couple days ago. I don't know what happened. It was so crazy. Spongebob. Oh, hi, Spongebob the Bob. <laughs> the Bob. That's the perfect description. Spongebob Squarepants is a square sea sponge who has appeared in a few vintage episodes of SML. He's a kind-hearted and an amazing cook. He appeared in... In vintage episodes? Oh, you know what? In vintage, that means like older episodes, I'm assuming. Unless that means like nowadays, but I don't think so. He looks more like a dish sponge, but he is a sea sponge. He has blue eyes and holes all over him. His favorite outfit is brown square pants with a pack. He also bears a strangling resemblance to Damien, which I'll look the Bob. Former. The Bob. You're so real for that. Occupation is a fry cook, the crusty craft, flipping patties all day and every day. The patties are made with love. His dark secret. The love inside the crab patties doesn't exist. What he truly means is is that the meat of the crab patty is something little specifically tailored for the restaurant. Has anyone seen Jeffy recently? Aha! Has anyone seen Jeffy recently? We haven't heard from Jeffy. Damien. Oh, he was one of the escapees. We'll look at that soon. Okay, so now we've looked at Patrick. We're gonna look at Bitter Man. Who the hell is Bitter Man? One way to find out. Hello? Work? <laughs> Things are being slow. Give me a second, guys. Okay, there we go. It's wet. I don't like it. Bitter Man. First exposure. What the fuck do you know? Some stupid video website. Do you think this is all for some shitty play place? We're talking about the World Wide Web. Haven't you seen the payout? The fans? I didn't even mention that, but I mean, just think it, it, it it's anything. It. Oh god, I cannot read. Guys, I'm trying to like act with this. It's not going well. Just don't think it's, it's, it's is anything base your life around with, with your you know what? Just don't think it's anything to base your life around with the health you're in. It's seriously affecting you. Your hands are turning yellow. You're getting abrasive with household objects while filming. At a border viewpoint, I would have based it off a simple rough house during recording. I'd let you off with a stern warning. But this? This isn't you. He's talking, about t he's talking to somebody and it's not us. I Final exposure. I, I don't understand. How did... How did this happen? Your fingers, your arms, it's, it's that puppet. I don't know how, but I need you to stop wearing that puppet. Oh, okay. Time and time again, I've requested the betterment of your health, but... What a lovely day. Do you think they're waiting for us on set? I can't wait. I really can't. Do you mind gripping my hand? I promise I'll play the lead role this time. What are you? Interesting. That's a nice name for him, I agree. Do you think he'll like his voice? Interesting. Poppy's being generally loose is spreading some kind of mucus. I don't know what the fuck it is. You remember how close we used to be? How your warmth, the war how much warmth it brought? How you'd enjoy playing on the couch every day? 
It's been a while since I saw you, you know. You should put it on. Put it on for me, please. Please put it on. Put it on. Put it on me. 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 Stinking like shit. The flute appearance. Appearances. The park. The house. A lovely ride out. Tabletop tennis inside. Crowley. Ouch! Ding! Well, that shouldn't be coming out of anything living. Let's pay some advice. Interesting. The puppet. What's this all about? Blank. What are you? What is that? I'm not sure. Oh, it's like sensor. Oh, it's a sensor bar. Like, 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 bleep, what are you type shit, right? Interesting. Okay. Okay. Little sweetie meats. I think I already checked this one out. Let's double check. I think I checked this one out, but we're gonna find out again. No, never mind. Hm. Nothing but the pure sweet fat of the hog. Nothing but pure sweet fat of the hog. Was it Ham? Ham, like the character from Toy Story, wasn't he part of old SML? I don't remember. I, I really don't. I don't know. I've never watched the OG SML. Field One. Little Sweetie Meats is the name given to the collective mass stripping off of the newly cloned Marvins. Okay, it is an antithesis to make it Marvin's entire bank. This is exactly what makes little sweet sweat sweetie so fucking badass all the time. Field one two. Sweetie is an orthodoxly clonable due to his name, but very capable of creating useful results. He resides under the cloning facility near the collection of vats, surrounded by his iconic computers. I feel the need to mention, despite his intense desire to be eaten, he is not fit for consumption. Soon, however, things will change. Many things will change. Okay. Oh fuck yes, baby. Oh fuck, fuck yes. That's the shit's fucking awesome. Haha, uh -huh, the meat on getting eaten. Okay, you like four. Okay, I heard something with Dr. Finkel shits. Something going on with him, I've heard. Inspector Gadget! Factor Finkel fits after making meth. Yeah. Current. Factor fits after making meth. He ascended. <laughs> Dr. Fagel Finkel shits about Dr. Fing Fingertits was one of the few people that not listed as an escapee to have survived the day of imbalance with minimal harm done to him. After waking up from a coma, he is seeing the world he once knew all fucked up. He knew that what it was his job to fix everything the day of imbalance has caused. Dr. Fink Fingerballs went around capturing random entities with cages and bear traps set around the neighborhood. He is he then took entities to his lab and experimental experimented on them. His ultimate goal was to reverse the effects of the Day of Imbalance. He unfortunately died after running an experiment on something too dangerous for him. Some speculate that he is mistakenly locked eyes with Fraxon Jr. Uh oh. Dr. Fink. Ooh, let me break this down. Dr. F Funkel Dirt, sir. Oh, no, it's just spam. Had a Facebook page. Flumped up Krumpus. Biggles, flumped up Jiggles. Okay, so it's just a bunch of jumble. Is this just the Inspector ja Jabbit? Inspector Gadget thing? Is this supposed to be the background? I'm sorry, that sounded like Luigi's Mansion. I think that's just the theme. That's literally just the theme. Yeah, I think that's just the thing. Okay, interesting. Facebook.com, Dr. Finkel Sheets. Okay, let's see what the- oh! Thumbler, you're so naive. <laughs> is this someone's roleplay? <laughs> is this someone's roleplay? Interesting, okay. It's just, there's not much here. So this is just a, some random ass Facebook page for this guy. Okay, I think it is. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay. Let's continue reading. <laughs> I read Duggies, I remember. Goodman, I remember I read. Escapees, all right. Lore? Question mark? Lore! <laughs> I love lore. Oh my god, work. 
Sorry, guys. I have bad things going on. Z dude, Zeke dude on YouTube is the audience. Zeke, he was one of the original members of SML. I remember. Zeke had been far removed the Republic and was safe in the grasp of Atheon during the Day of Imbalance. The momentous turn of events, most believe, resulted in re ascending of Earth. Zeke currently resides in the second reality, internally blessed by his good heart and positive spirit. Danny Ann on Twitter is a prominent third party documenter in these events of the Espo Wiki meta. Charmix, cool guy, sources. Okay. Let's look at this stuff. Z dude, big ups. Damien, big ups. Hi, SpongeBob. Charmix, big ups. Is it? Okay. <laughs> History, Athleon, the God excuse. Okay, so Athian history. Athian is the God excuse. Was an Anthophorus Rulinius Temperer sometime in the last six thousand years. The day of imbalance befell us, resulting in the overturning of Earth and transmorphizing our existence into what it is today. It is well documented that the imbalance of resediment of Earth occurred in Tandurim. Tandem, whatever, I can't read. And it is common belief that the Godix previously considered a Chuya, protector of life and virtue, cause had a massive hand in event. Appearance, description, appearance varies, relies on the pre monumental illustrations in scripture, pencil drawings, and iPhone text messages. Modern illustrations of the Atheon usually share commonalities from two interpretations. Anthro and organic interpretation, they often had um, set multicolored rings or white on um, black wing, fair skin, long golden hair, wearing only a white robe and accents of gold, pure and purple red, associated with imaginary tents, contain symmetrical flocks of doves and ravens, white butterflies, purus, I think that's like the uh, scientific name, and black moths. Uh, Purus rape, and then bistum betulia, I don't know, I'm pretty sure that's the scientific names. Ariogenius is celestial interpretation. On the interp- they are portrayal free flowing the compound of supplementary mist with the red streaks resemble wounds and shooting on the yellow cold red and yellow embers that this is similar to, to the popular interpretation of the divinities that are akin to microplanets associations to the SML and the SML class Ethan was responsible for the regeneration the regeneration of poopy and provided him with his subline power okay so he's the reason why Pablo is God it is it it was once of a common belief that Poopy had became forever eternal from his suspense, but in actuality, Poopy reincarnates every 100 years. His brain preserves in all its purity, unlike the rest of his body. Oh, okay, so he's literally God because of this thing. Subsequent banishment. It's taught that the Ethian was deemed to responsible for the Arrhenius capitalism and was exiled to the Desphys. Des he ex. De 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 God, I can't read! D, D hexoplane of the untold seraphim. Okay. Celestial in game. Interesting, interesting. Okay, day of imbalance. Oh, and yeah, it's just the same thing. Okay. Yeah. Let me double check with the poopy link. It just leads us to. Yeah. So he's just got again. Resulted in their signings of Earth. Once again, the Atheon. So, this thing is responsible for everything, I'm assuming. So, did, so Zeke in his online and Zeke had been far removed from the public. I was safe in the grass at the Atheon there and So, the Atheon, whatever it may be, cool guy. Hey! Guy number 3068! Hello, shit, this guy, appearance only. Gordon is from the old incarnation of the guys. He's a dead guy because he shapes floors. Okay. Personally, this guy is caring and sweet. He was once caught jumping a cat, so now he is known as the foot guy. Okay. In elementary school, he became popular when he was swimmed a detective. When he swimmed a detective in the marijuana. He is also elongated about hurting his friends. He cleans his bowels very much like Wilford. Okay. Crime, stealing cookies, being like Bart Simpson, being opinionated, hurting his friends, hurting his friends. So he has hurt his friends. He's also elongated about hurting his friends. Okay, interesting. He's not a safe guy. 
cool, uh, interesting Damien out on Twitter. Let's find this one out. H, nothing special here. Mm. Yeah, it's just someone's Twitter. Yeah, this is just someone's Twitter. They're chilling. They are chilling. Okay, they're just chilling. Um, yeah, let's make sure you help Palestine with what you can. Okay, interesting. Sources. Let's find this one out. Okay, more here. This is just leading me. Okay. Oh, these sources are just like other links to stuff. Okay, turns out those sources are just links to other people's videos and like uh, that one Twitter account we just investigated with the uh, Damien and whatever. So, actually, let me look at the. That's just the guy's YouTube, right? Let's find out! Yeah, it's literally his YouTube. Oh, he's live right now <laughs> as I'm recording this? That's funny. Okay, so, yeah. It's not much here. So. We've read all the characters we know about right now. And I swear Lovell had a code there. I have to, I'd have to look at my own video with that. Unfortunately, I was trying to see if I could figure out the Goodman message code. I, I I couldn't really figure it out. I couldn't figure out what cipher it was for. Um, if you guys have any idea what it is, let me know. It also could just be a spam of just letters and whatnot. Because a lot of it just like didn't make sense what I found out. Because like, some of it had words like eyes or obese or she. One of the unscrambled versions, apparently it came out to be nosebleeds. Which, I don't know how that makes all s any sense, but I don't know. But, um, I, I really couldn't find much, and I'm, I'm so sorry for that. I, I'm, like, I, I, I know, I keep on saying this. Uh, uh, I'm pretty new to this and whatnot, so I'm really sorry for all of this. And, like, with, when it comes to coding and whatnot, like, I know some codes, I can figure out some codes, but not a lot. I'm not... I'm not very clever when it comes to thinking. I'm not there yet. So it's a little it's a little bit yikes, right? So I can't figure stuff oh, I dropped my mic. I can't figure stuff out. So I'm genuinely so sorry for that. Um but yeah, let me let's continue on with the video. You'll hear me constantly repeat, oh, it's Charlie's code, it's Charlie's code, it's changed, Charlie's code. No, nothing's changed. Everything was the same. I just, I had bad memory and the code was actually on Mr. Goodman. I'm, I'm so sorry, guys. I'm really so sorry. This video is so bad. But yeah, um, we'll try again next time. Episodes. The food that looks Marvin's new desk. Misery. Let's check this out. Ow. Oh, the food looks good. Typical modern slop filled with everything you dread. This last video is starring a living Jeffy. Okay, so it's that one. Marvin's new dance. Continue. Marvin's new dance. <laughs> oh, here's Marvin. <laughs> Hold up. The, this is Marvin's new dance. Okay, let's rewind that. Shit! Oh! Oh, oh my god, Marvin! <laughs> Made it up at studio, okay. Keep your eyes out of the wicked beast and stare out at the. Keep to sin and stare out the eyes of the wicked beast. Marvin just like. Wait, hold on, let me go back to that. 
Marvin is Marvin got murked. Holy shit. Camel eleven. Marvin got fucking murked, bro. Interesting. Keep to sin and stare out the eyes of the wicked beast. Okay, so that's that episode. Interesting. We've seen... So we haven't seen much of Jeffy, so my theory is that Jeffy's behind all of this. Game's house. So we've been here. That's just a house. Okay, Lance. Chris, Ulysses. Oh, it's Lavelle, right? Okay, Tito. Hey guys, I'm oh, fucking with the I'm talking! I'm talking! I'm talking! I'm talking. Oh. What? What? Oh, shit. What is going on? Uh, the sound's not working. I don't know if that's because of my stuff. Marvin? Houses. Did, did I glitch stuff out? Delete. Delete. What? What? Delete, delete hill. The silhouette. What? Delete hill F. Hill F. Oh my god. What the hell? What? Delete, okay. Marvin? You good, buddy? That was something. Hold on, I need to go back to that. I need to look at... That video again, cause it like kind of like glitched out for me. Hey guys, I'm back here with the I'm talking. Who's I'm dead talking, here? I'm talking, I'm talking. Oh. Charlie. Oh, this is Charlie's death, isn't it? Interesting. It probably works better if I'm on computer. Hey guys, I'm back here with the I'm talking. I'm talking. I'm talking. I'm talking. I'm talking. Oh. Chef pee pee. Keto puppet, maybe? I don't know. Chef pee pee. Store. Let's investigate that. Jerk store called. They're running out of you. Fuck you. Anyway. There's more to this. I. I'm on mobile, so I know I'm missing some stuff, but there's more to this, but I've covered a lot. I've covered, like, the rest of what was left, but there is still more. I know there is. I'm trying to figure it out. What it all could mean. Go back, go back. Kitchen. New house. Interesting, interesting characters. I know there's something with Charlie. He had a code that I wanted to break down. Interesting. I'm not getting that uh, seven ciphers of a thing. Am I late? Has ARG ended? I hope not. There's more to this. I just want to apologize for at this point in the video I'm reacting to the finale of the SML wiki as I managed to come across it. I didn't plan to as I wanted to like explore more but the, I was limited as I was on mobile so there's not a lot I could discover. And at the same time, some stuff might have been taken out of it, as I noticed, I think I mentioned this in the video, I noticed that, like, the seven ciphers, uh, seven meetings, like, or one meeting, uh, loading screen was gone, so I don't know if all that is still there. Um, I, but I just want to apologize, so, with me reacting to the finale, unfortunately, I didn't realize I could do full screen. Um, I, I didn't see the button there. The button's, like, right there, and I just did not, like, really see it, because I'm, like, really stupid when it comes to stuff. I did not notice it until, like, the later half of the video, 
and there might be some like weird cuts and whatnot as like I was having trouble loading the video so I'm or maybe weird cuts weird pauses I'm really sorry for that I again it's my first time really doing something like this I I didn't expect to come across the finale it's really my first time doing something like this so I, I'm gonna hope to do better next time I do uh, another thing like this but I'm sorry this is really annoying but I just want to say I'm so sorry that the video is not in full screen um, that has to be annoying because I know I get annoyed when I don't see the teacher do full screen so that had to be really annoying and I'm so sorry for that it doesn't get full screen to like a later half so yeah I, I just want to say I'm sorry for that So that I found the finale with this. Oh, hi, Pinkie Pie. So it's not an ERG, okay. Here. Oh my. So Jeffy's fucking dead. So the finale says so this like explains what happened. This is such a good YouTube food. <laughs> You did a really good job of all of this. Oh, Bowser's hanging back there! What the fuck? Look at Loki go. Luffy! I love Luffy! I miss Luffy. Okay. Oh, hi Lance. Jeffy. What is going on? Oh, hi Lovell. Oh shit. Uh oh. Oh! <laughs> TV show is this now. It's not a TV show, Jeffy. It's you to play. The board is my win. It's when I'm almost through a living room. Oh shit. So I can get my pants up. If you think I'm kidding, you can see it in my- to keep your mind right, thinking in the dimes like I can rule the world, but I just think I might throw them yeah, through case and fly up there. Oh. oh, I'm sorry, guys. I have to rewind it again. I don't know what's going on. Oh my god, what's going on, Jeffy? Hey Jeffy, my leg got sour. I'm about to go to the. Do you need anything? Uh, uh. Oh, Shippy, oh, 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 oh. that's my friend. Oh. Oh. What the FNAF music sound effect? Oh. Oh yeah. I might just watch the best of because I just miss Shippy, bro. <laughs> okay. Oh. Oh my. Sorry about the. I'm enjoying this though. This is great. So this week we're gonna try it out. Okay. Hopefully get something interesting. Uh, and hopefully something uh, as tasty as uh... Jeffy poster. <laughs> Marvin is never coming back. Damn, okay, Marvin, hey, hey. What? What? It's 
it's all it's all related to Jeffy. I I know. Oh, let me read this shit. Those are the most important things in the world right now, and they are registered new email. You are so cool. You are so cute. You are so cool. You are so cute. You are still super cute. You are. I gotta say. Okay. <laughs> You're really brave for putting yourself out there and meeting new people. Hi, can you shut the fuck up? Can you quit stupid fucking bitch moaning? Do you even fucking wonder why you're so hated? So many people. No, it's not because you have autism. You're smart enough to understand that. It's because you were a fucking pussy? Fucking pants? Sorry, I just hit my thing. You're, f you're fucking pantsy. You're satisfied. You're a sissified freak. You're some sick pedophile streak come true with your virgin mouth and your tight skin and your pathetic facial hair. A string of communication. Co a string of coming out of your back once pulled makes you vomit. Keep yourself thin. You're- I can't read that. It's covered. Embedded in the back, maybe, but inside is my journey. Can't talk fast. It, it and me can't talk. I- and I- and be small. A great smiking ship. It is the part it's parts it is the part it's small and have found treasure how to move its biggest treasure to the country for flag God made death so beautiful in death okay interesting so we have like a Marvin hate page with this oh I guess I had enough time to read it but I wasn't sure okay the music's nice oh check your favorite SMO <laughs> so oh FNAF I heard you got a new video game. Can I play it? No. Sully and Friends is a video game. I bet I could beat this. Oh, damn. This is crazy. This is so well done. Oh, item Logan. Oh, shit. Flesh. Go back to that. Go back to that. Go back to that. Guys, I like sneeze it out my nose is all up. okay flesh sheet flesh sheet okay so flesh sheet, flesh sheet. fake this is so well done fucking fired oh it's more wow this is insanely well done okay Jeffy. Oh, Chef Peepee. -pee. Different juniors. Interesting. Jeffy, get it. Get in the car. Yeah, yeah, I got you. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh. 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 Oh, shit. What's going on here? Oh, okay. Hi. Hi, Marvin. you're here. Isn't it obvious? This is a metaphor for moving on. Moreover, all of this is a, just a pompous proclamation of the current state of, well, you know. Sorry, I had to read that really fast because I'm bad at reading. Anyone could be in this elevator. I wouldn't wish this position on my worst enemy. Really now? Don't give me a jump scare. Don't give me a jump scare. Is that it? Oh, that is it. Okay. So. I don't want to replay. So then. 
So we technically reached a finale with that one. I, I didn't expect to reach it so soon. I, there's still more to crack and like maybe I took too long and so I couldn't really crack it. The SSL wiki. Store news. Interesting. Because I don't longer see the seven ciphers meeting so I missed out on that. I'll have to... I know he had a code here. I was going to use... I'm going to have to look at my old... My other video. Interesting. So... Is it really that? Is it? Is that really it? Day of Imbalance, which is the Atheon. Yeah, this is the Atheon. Which is the reason why... Okay, so apparently it's not an ARG. I thought it was an ARG, I don't know, I saw bits and pieces of it, I considered it an ARG, but it's not an ARG, so we're not gonna call it an ARG, um, uh, I don't know if that means I should change the title of my, uh, video. I don't know, but, interesting, they're running, okay, Tumblr, house, I don't know, could that be, really be it? I expect you to find more, but there is probably more, it's just because I'm on mobile, so... I, I probably just couldn't find more because I was like already on mobile. Hello? Oh, I gotta go to the other one. Because I was like on mobile. So one flush that chandelier. That really is the old place. That's crazy. Interesting. And with that, that concludes today's video. Um, if you made it this far, thank you. Sorry it was a long and messy video. I, I, I don't know what to say for myself. I'm off a of script again. I don't know what I'm going to be talking about right now, but, um, yeah, sorry it was a long and messy one. I, I do apologize for that, but we tried at least. We did manage to reach the finale, but... I don't think we're done just yet, because there are a lot of stuff that I know I need to find. And I meant to find some while recording the video, but I forgot to, as there it was some stuff that people, you guys in the comments will point out, oh, there's this thing and that thing that I wanted to investigate, but I kind of forgot about it while recording because I'm just all over the place. So I do apologize for that, but there is probably more to go. Um, if you guys want me to specifically find something, give me some directions to it, but don't spoil what it is, okay? And then maybe, just maybe, we can make a part three to this where we can go over the things we missed. Um, again, I am limited on what I can do as I am on mobile. I don't have a computer that's able to record and do all of this, so things are a little sketchy and whatnot, so I may not be able to get everything as I had been saying throughout the video. However, I'll still do my best to try and find stuff out. If you guys want me to find specific things, or you guys want me to look in specific areas, because maybe you don't have a clue, but you feel like there's something there, let me know, and then maybe I can make a part three, maybe we can answer those questions, maybe we can find out more about this. Um, overall, it is not an ARG. I thought it was before. That's that's my fault. People in the comments already pointed out, oh, it's not an ARG. And people are like, oh, this is a weird analog core. I don't know if it's analog core. I don't know if it's an ARG. Apparently, it's not an ARG, according to the creator on the website. And, of course, we respect that. It. It's just, a lot of people say it's just some shit posts. And you know what? It is. But you know what? I like it. I think it's really cool. Well done. A lot of time was put into it. I think it's excellent. The creator, if you are watching this, you did an amazing job with this. It's incredible how you just managed to put all this together. And I still want to crack things down and break stuff and see what I can find out. There are codes that are that I came across that are within the wiki and whatnot. There are codes, but I couldn't figure out what to how to break them. So if you guys have any ideas on how I could break them, like website suggestions, cipher suggestions, we can see what we can figure out. So don't give me direct answers, okay? Just give me like a tool I can use to figure stuff out because I, I'm not very good at code breaking to an extent. But that's besides the point. Overall, um, it was a great experience. I really liked it. It was fun to find stuff out. Everything was, like I said, well done, put together. Does it have war aspects? Yes, I got jump scared a couple times. I can't believe I got jump scared at stuff I knew was gonna jump scare me. It's so weird. But it is what it is, right? So yeah. Um, if you did make it this far into the video, um, why not, like, I guess, subscribe or whatnot if you, you are interested in what I do. 
You can even leave suggestions if you want me to check out other things. It doesn't have to be SML related. It can be or it can't be. Either way, you can you let me know in the comments or wherever I'll be able to see it. Where you can give me suggestions on what I should check out and make a video about, or if you want uh, questions answered and see if I can do it. So. Yeah, if you have any ideas on what I can do next, feel free to leave a comment. If you want a part 3 to this where we start breaking down what we missed, let me know and give me some pointers on what I should find, if you know any pointers. So yeah, I, I don't know how to do all of this. I am just very much all over the place, but sorry, again, no script, I don't know what I'm saying. Um, so yeah, that's that's it for today's videos, but- <laughs> today's videos? Okay. Today's video. Um, but before I end, I just want to say Thank you guys so much for all the love and support you were giving me on my last SML wiki video. I couldn't believe how that took off and how a lot of people found me entertaining. I was honestly definitely overwhelmed by the amount of people coming in, subscribing, watching my content. I couldn't believe it. And honestly, thank you guys so much for that. It really means a lot. I really didn't expect that one bit. I, I legit thought, oh, it's not going to do too good because I, I didn't think it was a good video. I felt like I could do better, but... I didn't know what I could do better with, I just felt like I could do better because I had better videos, right? And I didn't expect it to take off like it did because I thought it was like lit to the trend because it seemed like an underground trend, but I guess maybe not. Maybe I was just in time. And so I, I couldn't believe it. So I honestly just thank you guys so much. It really means a lot. I really didn't expect that. And I hope I can continue to grow. I hope I, you guys can continue watching my videos if you find me interesting. It's okay if you don't. I mean, I don't blame you if you don't find me interesting. I'm a little weird. I don't know what I'm saying half the time. I get stuff wrong a lot, so I don't I don't blame you for like not being interested in what I do, just interested in what's out like what I'm covering. It's fine, it's whatever, right? It is what it is, right? It's YouTube. But yeah. Um again, sorry this was such a long video, but honestly, I just thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys for subscribing, checking me out, and watching my other videos that I put out. Leaving comments, I love reading comments. I love reading comments. I love seeing what you guys put down and what you guys say. It's so much fun. I said that in my last video about the MLP and affection they use. Um, I love reading comments and I love responding to them. I, I keep responding to each and every one of them. Some of them, I don't quite understand what you guys are saying, but I'm like, yes, right? It's 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 silly, but I I very much do enjoy comments. I really appreciate you guys' support and what you're what you're giving me right now. Even though it may not seem like a lot to people on the outside, 500 subs, that's not really a lot when it comes to like YouTube standards. Uh, but to me, to me, that that was, I couldn't believe it. I My mind was blown. I was like, there's no way all these people came in and just subscribed to see what I do. It, it just blew my mind. And I generally s appreciate each and every one of you for just watching me and checking me out. And if you're not subscribed, please subscribe, please. Okay, all right. I want to. <laughs> I want to be able to do this. I want to be able to try stuff out, accomplish some things I've always wanted to accomplish. But if it doesn't work out, it doesn't work out. If it does work out, it does work out. We'll just have to see what the future holds, you know. But overall, thank you guys so much for everything. It really does mean a lot. I keep saying that. I'm. I'm just sorry. I'm all over the place. I'm just like completely ecstatic, and I was just completely overwhelmed seeing everybody coming. So. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys for all your support that you've been giving me. Um, thank you for all your comments and thank you guys for like trying to help me out throughout this. Once again, feel free to leave a comment on what I should do next, what you want me to cover, what an what questions you want answered. I'll see what I can do. And if there's stuff in the wiki that I did miss that you really want me to check out, let me know. I'll see what I can do. Once again, I am on mobile, so I won't be able to get everything you guys are looking for. But apart from all that, thank you guys so much. Let me actually end the video now. I keep rambling and rambling. It's really annoying. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys after my nap. Bye-bye.